Dusty, what are you supposed to get me for our two-year anniversary? Well, first of all, you I just want to tell the audience very quickly that when I congratulated you this morning, you told me that you were the bride in our relationship and I was to buy you a gift. I am. Not happening. I okay. Am. Not happening. Bridezilla. 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 Okay. I just want to tell you something very quickly. That it is it mm. is our second year anniversary. We are not going to do calls. Because there is a man that you have oh, you watched. Lied? I lied. I'm good at you that. You lied. I'm very good at that. There is a wow. man. There is a man that you have watched. You have admired. You have emulated. You. He is a giant, and I mean a giant in the broadcast world. He did the podcast within the first week or so of when we launched. He did our show when we first launched. I called. He did not hesitate. I give you, Mr. Bob Costas. Oh. Boy, one now, of my favorite people, listen. period. Cu Cuomo, first of all, happy anniversary, yes. And we'll leave out the sort of verbiage that typifies our usual text exchanges, since much of the world is eavesdropping on us here. But it is a measure of my devotion to you that I am sitting here in my den while in the living room the Mets have just scored three times at the top of the ninth in an elimination game, down 2 nothing to the Brewers. They now lead 3-2, for all I know, maybe 4-2, in an epic comeback. So instead, I have turned my attentions toward you. Well, first of all, Bob, I love you. And thank you for being my friend. Uh, and I've been following right the game on my you. phone. But I do, I do have to point something out uh, that won't matter yeah. much uh, to people, but it matters a heck of a lot to me. Behind Bob mm -hmm. Costas is about 100 Emmys, OK? One of them, he won for a phone call with Coach Jerry Sandusky. The same That's year true. that Diane Sawyer and I had labored for over a year putting together an investigation and a special on J.C. Dugard, and only to be beaten at the Emmys by Bob Costas, whose personal investment in the reporting was about nine and a half minutes. He won, we lost, and it's right behind him right now. But don't uh, worry, yeah, I don't hold a grudge. What, well, <laughs> obviously not. <laughs> I, I had to do a, a couple of hours of preparation, but you're right. I was on the air with them for about 10 minutes, and you did all of that <laughs> legwork you know, over months and months, and there's an inherent unfairness in that, but, you know. No. No, you made, you made a huge difference. It actually started a change in our culture. And, Bob, uh, you have always been a friend to me. Uh, I love having you. You told me to keep going with this and to do it and that it mattered and right. not to let my head get caught up in other things. And I appreciate you being my friend. Get back to the game. Thank you. Uh, I rely right, so Chris, much. I'll see you soon. Uh, Happy anniversary. Please, Bob. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, and I'll tell you guys all something. Everybody has a superpower, right? Every individual does. Everybody has something about themselves that makes them special. I'll tell you what mine is. I have an amazing, almost magical ability to draw better people to me in my life. My friends are this ridiculous, ridiculous composite of really solid men and women who never hesitate, in fact, probably take more opportunity than they should, to put me in check, to let me know what's right, what's wrong, what's good, what's bad. I have a wife who is her own level of tolerance, and if it weren't for her, I would have never gotten back. I have a work wife in Dusty. If it were not for her, I would have never come back. I have a boss in Mike Corn that if he hadn't wanted to see me personally to say I'm supposed to be on TV, I would have never come back. So that is my magic talent. I have a team that took a chance on me here at News Nation, a new place, a guy who was getting up off the canvas, and all these young people some not so young, decided to take their reputation, take their future, and put it in my hands to try this together, that is some kind of blessing. Amazing. And I know that's why I'm here. I know that's why I'm able to do what I do. I know that's why I'm able to have a chance to become a better person in the relationships that matter to me with my kids and my wife and my friends and my families because I'm blessed with better people around me. And if you are like me and you build that circle, the court makes the king. The court makes the king. Dusty, I love you, and thank you for being with me for two years. I love you, too. And our bosses, all three of them, Corn and Sean Compton and Perry Sook, are all texting me and telling me to wish you a very happy anniversary, and they're very grateful for you.
I thought you were going to say they were upset because we, uh, we missed a break. No, we didn't or miss because, a break. Or because Nick was walking behind me and they thought they were going to kill me. No, no. They know, they know how we roll. They, they're used to someone's walking behind me here. They know how we roll around here. <laughs> and we haven't cut any breaks today. That was our anniversary gift to them. We made it on time. We got well, one more Dusty, to Well, Dusty, I love you. Thank you for doing this with me. I couldn't do it without you. That is, that is the truth. Hey, thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your screen. And don't forget, click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.